friends, welcome back to Endo Tales from Life. In this episode, we are going to do a product review and also talk about something that was discussed in our previous video that you all wanted to know more in detail. Yes, it is about the continuous usage of Apex Locator during rotary instrumentation. So this can be done in different ways. One with the same uh, Apex Locator Endo motor that you already have in your clinic where you can just attach the Apex Locator's file holder to the Endo motor uh, that is the rotary file and start using and this is how it is set up. You can just attach the file holder to the rotary file and the lip clip of the Apex Locator is placed in the patient's mouth contacting the oral mucosa and when you start working both of them are integrated together. Or there are also some endomotors where you have the integrated function and most of these endomotors have a separate accessory like this an attachment that is attached to the head that comes in contact with the rotary file to complete the circuit. So the lip clip is touching the patient's uh, oral mucosa and the file that is in contact with this accessory, extra accessory that you attach to your handpiece completes the circuit. Now, this video we are going to do a product review about this particular endo motor which makes this function very simple and easy uh, because it does not require any special attachment to the head of the handpiece but still you can integrate the PEX locator and your rotary file. So that's why we chose this uh, endo motor when I did a, a small search a lot of people are asking me about endo motors that have this integrated function. Uh, I could only narrow down to this endo motor which is called the endo pilot this is from super endo and you can see that it's clearly mentioned that it is an integrated endometrix endo motor where the digital apex measurement can be done in real time during continuous rotary instrumentation and I acknowledge and thank dental card for uh, again providing the endo motor for demonstration. So this is how I received the package from the dental card and when I unboxed it I just picked up all the accessories that were present in a presentable form for you to know what are all present when you buy this Ender motor. Uh, so it's a C type charger which is also present but I haven't shown it in this picture. Apart from that you have the handpiece, the head and some other accessories like oiling devices etc. So uh, we just start off by fixing the head of the endo motor to the handpiece and this is a 360 degree rotatable uh, head and to turn the endo motor on you press the power button on and the program number 0 is the reciprocation mode which is an open reciprocation mode meaning you can change the forward and reverse reciprocating angles according to the file that the according to the company's file that you're using like reciproc or wave one or any other reciprocation angle that you want to customize is also possible and apart from that we have 10 different programs and one dedicated apex locator program as well so just like how you do the adjustments in a digital watch you can adjust the speed talk and there are also some artificial intelligence programs here like uh, automatic start and off stop that is you just place the endo motor when the, when the file touches the tooth it starts revolving and when you take it out of the tooth it stops so there are also some other function like automatic slowdown or reduction in talk once you reach the apical third so let us uh, talk about the apex locator function this can be used in two different ways so it can also be used as a dedicated apex locator that is a pure apex locator function or it can also be integrated let's see first how it's used as a separate apex locator so we just need to attach this cable for that and this cable has two slots on the other end and to one slot you can attach the file holder if you are going to use a traditional apex locator method and to the other slot you attach the lip clip
So we need to go to the M10 mode or M10 program which is a pure apex locator program. And for the usage of apex locator they are given these accessories, the cable, there are two file holders and two lip clips. But let's talk about the most exciting function or mode in this program that is the integrated endometric program which applies for all the rotary program that is from M0 to M9 in all these programs you can integrate the apex locator just like that. So see here I don't need the file folder at all so all I need is only the lip clip so the other slot will be just left empty and the lip clip is going to act as one electrode and the head of the handpiece here is the other electrode there is no need of file holder so when you just place the rotary file in this handpiece head it is going to conduct or act as an electrode the head of the handpiece by itself is going to act as an electrode so the circuit is complete and you can see that this is automatic in any of these rotary programs so it's not that it only works in one particular mode in all the programs starting from M0 to M9 this integrated function works and this is how we use it clinically I will place my lip clip touching the, any part of the oral mucosa and now the rotary file so you can see the rotary file in action with integrated apex locator on so this particular scenario I use the endomotor with the rotary file without knowing my working length I did not predetermine the working length with the radiographic method or a separate apex locator mode we just use the files integrated to the endomotor and this was my working length so uh, we all know that the radiographic apex is not where you need to stop we need to stop at the biologic working length where the pulp tissue ends and the periodontal tissue begins so the apex locators always show us a more accurate uh, biologic working length compared to radiographs so uh, that's why we stick to this and we do not go for the radiographic apex now the only um, difficulty i would not say difficulty uh, i would say what a clinician might face when you do not use a rubber dam is when the head of the handpiece is touching the mouth or oral mucosa the circuit becomes complete so uh, even before the file reaches the working length just because the endomotor head is contacting the patient's mouth you may get a false apex reading so to avoid this the manufacturer has given uh, two insulating rubber sleeves so when I attach the sleeve over the handpiece now even if the handpiece is going to contact the patient's mouth the circuit is not complete and only the file contacting the head of the handpiece will complete the circuit so people uh, I really recommend rubber dam in endodontics but if at all you are not going to use rubber dam then it's mandatory for you to use the sleeve there are two sleeves given along with this box so what I like about this endomotor compared to other endomotors that have this integrated mode is that there is no need of this, any extra attachment which is generally making your handpiece uh, head little longer and can also reduce the length of the file for example if it's going to be a 21 mm file attaching these uh, uh, this uh, extra accessory is going to reduce 2 mm of it so that's not going to happen with this endomotor because it's just like uh, any other mini a head uh, uh, cordless endomotor so that's the beauty of this product and the next good thing is obviously uh, it's much economical and also comes with a uh, one year warranty so let me again disclaim that I do not have a financial um, attachment to this company or product but this is an unbiased review just because people are asking about which endomotor has this integrated mode this product stood out and I know a lot of people will be asking about the serviceability so as of now dental card uh, have uh, you can go to this particular products link and they have clearly mentioned that the dental card is going to uh, provide service for this product themselves so I hope you like this product review will be coming 
with more of product reviews and also clinical technique demonstration through our endo tales thank you for watching and see you soon